All right, man, we back on my way to work again. Um, We got to stop all this screen watching. And for those of you that don't know what screen watching is, so screen watching is basically when, like, if you're playing a, a like, let's say if you're playing, like, Halo, like, back in the day, like, Halo 2, Halo, Halo 1, when you play multiplayer and shit, and you can see it's split screen because, you know, like, playing online and shit like that wasn't really a thing like that yet. So it was split screen multiplayer, like Halo, GoldenEye, you know what I'm saying, 007, like all those games that use split screen. And you never wanted to be the dude that was watching what the other players was doing. It's basically cheating, right? Like you're seeing where they are, and they be like, bro, stop screen watching. We are in a time of a lot of fucking screen watching right now, and I, mainly because of social media. We already know what social media is. Social media is the fucking highlight reel. Everybody be showing the wins. Everybody be showing all the glamour and the, and the, you know what I'm saying? They be showing all the good shit. They be showing when they actually be leaving the house and shit like that, which they probably don't do like that. You know what I'm saying? Everybody be taking videos of when they be traveling. And I'm not knocking nobody that's doing those things, but it's like you got to understand what you're looking at and understand um, what that can do to you. And, and how that can make you feel inadequate about your own reality. You know what I'm saying? Because, again, they're controlling. Like, social media allows us to control uh, what people see. It allows us to uh, control... Like, it, it, kind of cre- it kind of gives us the ability to kind of create an avatar. Like, in these video games and shit, how you create a character and stuff like that. You can do the same shit with social media now. You can create an avatar and you can create... Uh, a version of yourself that really isn't real. You know what I'm saying? And we got to be aware of that when people are putting these things on the internet and, and you know, we see people that are our age or younger or, you know what I'm saying, doing things that we may want to do. Like, oh, this person's traveling. Oh, this person got their own business or whatever. Like, yeah, that's cool and all, but you got to, you got to understand that they're only, they're choosing, they're picking and choosing what they're showing you. So you can't think that this person got it made or they got it figured out and and you slacking because of what they handpicked to put on their page to 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 post on their page like they picked they picked that so it could look a certain way so it could come off a certain way you know what I'm saying they purposely did that and again it's not saying that anything is wrong with those people or those individuals that do that but you got to have a strong mind period you had a strong. You gotta have a strong mind. Period. To live in this world, and you gotta have a strong mind if you're gonna be using the internet on a regular basis. If you're gonna be on social media on a regular basis, you gotta have a strong mind because if you don't, a lot of the shit that you see that you don't have is gonna make you feel like you're less than, or you're not doing enough, and you don't need to be feeling like that. Like there's no way to be living life feeling like you're not doing enough, and and you know what I'm saying you behind in life. That shit is not true, bro. Like. That that feeling of being behind in life, but that shit is that shit is bullshit because everybody's journey, everybody's path is different, and everybody reaches certain points in their life when they're supposed to reach it. You don't got to get to a certain point when you're 21, when you're 25, when you're 27, when you're 30. None of that shit fucking matters, bro. You learn what you learn when you learn it. You know what I'm saying? I know plenty of people. I'm 29, bro, and a lot of my friends that are aware of the same shit that I'm aware of are a lot younger than me. You know what I'm saying? And I don't look at them like, dang, bro. Um, like how they figure this shit out before me. I don't be, but I be applauding them and I be telling them that I'm proud of them and I'm glad because I wasn't really on this shit until I was like 24 and I got people that's uh, 20, 23, you know what I'm saying? I got, I got homies that are young like that and I just be amazed and proud of them for even being able to figure out, you know, the truth and be and be and be interested in seeking the truth at such a young age because I wasn't there yet at that time. But I applaud them and I'm glad. And it's 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 more and more young people starting to become more aware of these things as time goes on. So I'm I'm happy when I see that shit. I don't get mad. I don't get jealous. Fuck no. I don't have no time for that. I'm a fucking man. I have zero reason to be jealous of anybody. You know what I'm saying? Because if you're jealous, then that just shows how inadequate you feel about what's going on in your life. So anyway, man. Stop all that screen watching, man. Live your own life. Don't let social media fool you into believing anything. You know what I'm saying? Live your life. You know what I'm saying? Leave social media alone sometimes. And and don't take it so serious. 
Social media is 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 a tool. It's a great tool, but don't let it consume you. You know what I'm saying? Be yourself on social media. Don't be trying to come off and seem a certain way. Try to seem like a high value man or I'm an alpha male. Fuck all that shit, bro. Just be you. You know what I'm saying? Don't don't fall for this this dumb shit that social media got a lot of these people doing, man. That's all I got, man. I'm gonna catch y'all on the next one, man. Y'all take it easy. Peace.